<laughs> and that we create information flow that this information can really be flowed between all of us, because that will really help us stay accountable to our promises and to our intentions. Thank you, David. Yeah. <laughs> Doctor, any final remarks? I would really hope that RMB in this context doesn't exclude foreigners. <laughs> in this case, I find this is a good idea, and of course, acceptance also hinges upon the degree or the share of the value chain which is produced in this country. And as I said, in the solution of poorly care, there's 80% cent which is available. And also it could be built by, in, by the people themselves in a short time. It could be rebuilt. But this is only one of many solutions. And I think a, a situation with a backlog of 300,000 houses is requiring a number of clever solutions because there are a number of preferences. So I think the Turingian delegation is willing to work with this new group, which you just have established, or at least proposed. Um, but I think it's very important for the acceptance that, that you see the production process, that you see it is made here, it's not brought from somewhere. It's an innovative thing, but it's an innovation within the population, which is also shared by the population. It's nothing from outside. Thank you. I see the minister writing here furiously, so I'm going to give her 30 seconds just to give her concluding remarks. Well, thank you very much, uh, uh, dear moderator and uh, my colleagues. Uh, I finally just want to say that uh, uh, the backlog and the category that cannot access mortgages through commercial institutions, it is a market on its own. And I'm calling for the investors who are willing and they have some other financial instruments that could chip in and work with the Ministry of Urban and Rural Development to address this uh, backlog are uh, welcome to, uh, to join us so that at least we, 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 we provide the breakthrough as far as this backlog is concerned. And I would just like to say uh, to His Excellency the President, they said, and this is not my word, but I like it, you don't need to be great to start, but you need to start to be great. Comrade President, you have started and you are great. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah, I'd just like to thank our panelists for their insights and their views. I think it's been a very engaging uh, topic. And we can continue, obviously, the discussions on the, in the corridors. Um, and then, uh, yeah, wish you all the best. Thank you very much.